that Mary had. A love that would not let go. No matter what happens, Mary stuck. If she could stick to death, the little stuff you're going through, you ought to be able to stick with it. Bow your head just where you are. All heads bow. Eyes closed. I want you to take a moment right now. Each and every one of us here. Just take a moment right now. And present yourself to this living Savior. First of all, thanking him for dying for you. Thanking him for making provision so that you may have a right to the throne of God and the tree of life. Thank him for choosing you. Hallelujah. You didn't choose him, he chose you. Thank him. Ah, you have a situation, you can put it, put it before him right now. We come this morning thanking God for being alive for us. Hallelujah. Oh, have mercy, Jesus. Have mercy, Jesus. Thank you, God, for every prayer that's been offered right now. Thank you for every life that is having a breakthrough right now. Thank you, God, for every family that is being set right right now. Thank you, God. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your grace. Oh, God, thank you for honoring us, God, in the name of Jesus. Thank you for looking beyond our fault, seeing our needs. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, God, we look forward to that day. Hallelujah. Then we can come before your presence as friend with friend. Hallelujah, Jesus. Every heart that is bowed right now, God, in the name of Jesus, I decree, decree and declare, God, whatever they would have asked of you right now, manifest it in their lives, that they would see them, God. Break that chain that hold them down, God. Break that chain that keep them to the graveyard. Take off those grave clothes, God, and let them leave it in the graveyard and dress them in the newness of your life. Hallelujah. So they have a new song on their lips. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Shout in their hearts. Thank you, God. Thank you for that heart that's being saved right now. Thank you, God. Thank you for that light that's been made, made, put better, made better right now. Thank you, God. We honor and we thank you, God. In the name of Jesus. Amen and amen. I want to ask you to do one more thing before we close. I want to ask you to stand. When I ask you to stand, please don't go to the back door. Dust has been instructed not to let anyone out until after we finish this. Let us stand. After that sober message this morning about Christ being alive, this joyful day, this joyful day, this joyful time in our life, I speak to all of you here today, every one of you, every one of you here today. If you're here today, you don't know Christ is the Savior, I want you to come on this day to be alive. This day for Christ to come alive in your life. You've been struggling with things in your life that you know some bad stuff that you want to be canceled on your life, but you come. You've just been going through some stuff and you and know every day just came to seem nothing is getting better. God wants to break that cycle in your life today. The choir is going to lead us. Thank you, young man. The choir is going to lead us in this song today. And the choir lead us if you're here today, join the young man who already stepped up and come. Come to Jesus today. Hear me. You might have just come to worship today, but God has spoken in your spirit. Just come and say, God, I acknowledge you as my Lord. I, I, I just want you to be alive in my life today. By coming, you are, you're saying to God, this is what you want to be done in your life. When you come, the door of the church is now open. As the choir leaves, I have a Savior. He is pleading in glory. Would you come? Don't watch who's around you. Thank you, my dear. Is there another? You come. God is speaking to you. Don't listen to anyone around you or look to see who's moving. 
You have to meet Christ for yourself. Come and join these two who've already come. God bless you, young ladies. Is there a young brother would you come? Young man, young lady. God is speaking in your spirit. He has spoken in your spirit. He has spoken in your spirit. You need to come. You need to come, my sister, my brother. God waits for you right now. Come. God is waiting. Would you come? And, uh,